What's going on YouTube? It's Thomas from the Barberstyle Directory and welcome back to another video. Now in this video, we're gonna be doing a Josh Gordon inspired haircut. Some of you may know him as Flash Gordon, the H receiver for the Patriots, but basically all it is is a drop fade and he has a long part going down the side of his head. Also, don't forget to check out the blog associated with this video. So click the link below and it'll take you, it'll take you right to the blog. Also, if you're new to this channel, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. That way you'll know whenever we release new content. And without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, we're gonna begin this haircut out by taking the one guard with the lever fully open. And as you can see, it's not gonna take off much. He pretty much likes his hair at this length, but it's just gonna smooth it down more. And I'm not gonna bore you with this, so I'm just gonna speed through it. Now, the emphasis of this video is not more so the drop fade. I've done the drop fade in so many videos. However, I will show you the steps, but as you can see, I'm gonna go through it just a little bit fast. So if you don't keep up, just feel free, feel free to rewind it. And I know, just as a side note, I know a lot of times you see me holding his ear down. When I tell you, if you were to ever slip up and cut that area right below his ear, when I tell you it will bleed for about five minutes, Trust me, I've done it by accident one time, and trust me, you don't want to do that. So that's why I always hold the ear down. You just want to practice good habits to avoid any type of catastrophic event. And also guys, a quick question. What are some of the, what type of haircuts do you guys wanna see? I feel like sometimes it's getting repetitive. So give me some ideas. Comment below in the uh, comment section. What do you guys want to see? That would really give me some direction as to where to take this channel. And I just wanna say to all of the old subscribers, thank you for being loyal and to the new subscribers, Thank you for subscribing as well. We're, we're headed in a good direction with this channel. I just need you guys to tell me what you wanna see. We are back to this haircut. We're just moving right along. Like I said, this is really isn't the emphasis of the haircut. We're gonna to get to it in just a second. So right here, you see me prepping the hairline and then you just gotta jump right into it. When you're dealing with wavy hair, a lot of times it doesn't want to cooperate. So you have to kind of keep combing it and just going back at it because the hair will tend to curl up. And you'll see what I mean in just a second. Now when you're doing a part, especially with someone that has wavy hair, the hair tends to, it wants to split. I can't really explain it. You, you'll see in just a second what I'm talking about. But you really have to make sure you keep combing the hair. And you wanna make sure that you take your time. See how the hair is wanting to kind of separate a little bit? Right there at the top. I know you can see that, yep. But what you don't want to do is panic. Don't try to panic and make it wider. It's really just the hair out of place and you have to keep combing it back and forth. So here you see me, me working at it, just trying to get it straight. When you cut into waves, the hair tends to split like it is now. But don't worry, you, you'll see me fix it in just a second. I'm just using the corner of that blade and just working at it. And you can see now it's starting to straighten up. And I didn't mess up or anything like that. It's just when you cut into a wave, the hair tends to separate and that's all that happens. 
Now the next time he comes back and gets a haircut, the part, it, the hair, it won't separate like that. But this is just a quick, straightforward, and to the point video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and I will see you guys on the next video.